I got him, Ms. Oates. Marika, I had to come. I had a premonition something happened to your brother. Premonition? I wondered why he was so eager to have us meet. Now I understand. He too had a premonition. He knew that we would have to work together to solve this mystery. Ah, uh, well, I'm not sure that I am. Jessica, you must. Please. I don't understand what she's doing. Well, she is looking for the right object to use in psychometry. I don't think I ever heard that word before in my life. Well, it has to do with using an object to divine something about the person who owns it. silence, so I can focus my thoughts on Buck's favorite photograph. Don't be alarmed by anything I might say. Please, don't cry out, or my concentration will be broken. I see Buck asleep in his bed. An intruder opens the door and quietly comes into the room. I cannot see a face. I sense that the intruder is someone with a guilty secret. And in the right hand, a gun with a silencer. Buck senses the danger and wakes. He starts to get up. The intruder fires. Buck falls back on the bed. The intruder uses a pillowcase to mop up the blood, then tosses it under the bed. The intruder lifts Buck's body and carries him out like one might carry a child. I feel the presence of someone else, someone in the bathroom listening, a witness to the murder. Jessica, have I given you enough? Is there any more to tell? Yes, but I find myself turning from it with dread. Wanting it not to be so. We must hear it all. I see a chamber in the ground. So very dark. So very cold. A grave. But not an ordinary grave. A deep shaft. A well. An old well. <laughs> Buck's body is thrown there by the killer. No, I don't believe this. My father is alive. Shh. You'll break your concentration. I don't give a damn. Sally, wait a minute. I've had enough of these horrible party games. Psychometric readings, they always give me a migraine. It was very impressive. I can certainly see how your special talents could help the police to solve murders, wherever that was. London. Scotland Yard called me in several times. Oh, how absolutely fascinating. And did you locate victims or murderers? How can you ask me so many questions? Can't you see I'm suffering? Oh, I'm so sorry. It's just that this subject is so interesting to me. Please excuse me. I have the need of some fresh air. That awful woman. Jessica, I'm sorry for running out like that. Oh, no need to be. I almost ran out with you. But something puzzles me. Sally, did your father have any maps of this property? There's no indication of a well on the property. You sound disappointed. 
I wanted to find it and prove that Marika was wrong. Have you got a magnifying glass? Yes, just as I thought. Did you find a well? No, but I found something else. A circle with a C in it. We'll meet Tom here first thing in the morning.